thousands of people have converged onto Tybee Island for the 14th annual Pirate Fest. News 3's Kelly Antonacci is live there now where restaurant owners say business is booming. Kelly. Well, Trish, today is one of the last days of beach season and one of the busiest. Right now, a pirate parade is wrapping up on Butler Avenue and live music is starting right behind me. Everyone is in search of their own pirate's treasure, from the best costume to the cash. Fanny's on the beach, packed with people and waiters working double time. Don't get tired till you sit down, so yeah. we don't sit down. Can't, got to keep moving. And business is booming. Unlike last year when Tropical Storm Irma postponed the festival. We're making up for it this year. We open and we all close. It's just the way that it is because we're that busy. We don't even get breaks, but it's good. It's worth the money and it's fun. That fun is what ships in people like Charlotte Holland. I'm definitely having next year. Women in her group come from as far as San Diego. You women will love it. You are just the sort of women who would love Pirate Fest. You must come and, and join me. And so we pulled it all together. For others, braving this 90 degree heat is an annual tradition. It's been amazing. I can't believe the uh, participation and I can't believe how much everybody gets into it. It's been really great. It's the bouncy house, a petting zoo. What he is a thinking of, he doesn't know himself. And live music that brings all ages together for one last day under the sun. There's many, many different people, different cultures, different outfits, and it's really nice to see. Well, the fun ends tonight with a DJ dance party at 10 o'clock, and if you can't make it out here today, it continues into tomorrow. Admission is $15 and completely free for kids under 12. Live on Tybee Island, Kelly Antonacci, WSAV News 3.